Hey guys, I'm Matt from PSI Conversion, and in this video, we're gonna go over how to hook up your electronic fans to your project. I'm gonna be using our kit 1010 fan relay kit. As you can see on this board here, it's a little bit more complete than a generic relay kit would be. This has a connector separate that you would have to splice onto your relay, which is just blunt cut wires. Our relay kit, comes with a connector for your fan that is sealed and is a little bit heavier duty than your typical fan connectors, like these unsealed white plastic connectors that you see here. We also give you a fuse in line for 30 amps and our relay is completely sealed, which a generic relay may or may not be. So inside your relay kit, you're gonna have your relay and you're going to have a little bag. We provide you with the mating connector to our fan connector so that way you can upgrade the connector on your fans as well as a couple splices to connect to your project's wiring. Now to hook up the relay you're going to have two heavy gauge wires. The one with the relay or a fuse on it is going to go directly to your battery or constant power source. The other one is going to go out to your fan and like I said you may have to change your fan connector to match this one. And it's got a black wire which you're going to run to your chassis or to ground. You want to make sure this is grounded. The smaller wires, you have a red and a blue one. The red one is going to go on to a switch 12 volt source and your blue wire is going to be the trigger wire for the relay that's going to complete the circuit and turn your fans on. Now, if you have a PSI harness in our underdash bundle, we supply you with two electronic fan triggers from your ECM on Gen 3 and Gen 4 harnesses. They're going to be a dark green wire for fan number one and a dark blue wire for fan number two. On Gen 5, they're going to be a white and black wire for fan one and a blue and red wire for fan two. So this blue wire on your relay can get connected to either one of those or if you are using this relay in another application, however you are going to trigger your relay to turn on the fans, you can connect that to this source. Thanks for watching guys. Hope this video helps you get your project wired up and fired up. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, leave us a comment with any questions you have about this information or any videos that you want to see in the future. For any of your LS swap needs, go to psiconversions.com or to speak to one of our team members, you can call this number or email either one of these email addresses. We'll see you guys in the next video.